Because you already clicked in this video, you have two options now. Okay, let's try this again. Because you clicked in this video, now you have two options. You either join me on that seat and watch this video about decorations, or as the strong Viking I am, I'm gonna put you in this pile of bones that you see in here. That's also added by the mod. And if you guys didn't notice, I'm kidding. If you enjoy and wanna see more, make sure to drop your like and subscribe. Especially that subscribe, I'm trying to reach 1000 subscribers. And if you actually enjoy the content, you might as well subscribe. So now more or less, let's jump into the video. First things of first things, you need to have this bucket that you see on my hand. It will work as the hammer, it's pretty much the same thing and it's how you access all the decorations of this mod. And to craft this bucket, you only need two woods. It's very simple and you can access it very early into the game. These two items may feel like you already know them, but they have a different use on this mod. Now we'll show you what the use is. So I'm gonna go ahead and press 3, which is the trophy that I have and boom, oops, it's on the backside. Okay, I, it's my bad. Let me just go ahead and there we go. It's a way for you to showcase your enemy trophies, so that's nice. I love the idea. If you have a dedicated server, for example, you can showcase the trophies of all the bosses you defeated. And maybe the enemy club will run away because they know that. And, and actually that you're talking about dedicated servers right now, I may have a new of a dedicated server for you guys to play with me. I don't know if this is already online or not by the time I'm uploading this video, but check out my Discord, link will be in the description. If everything is going right, you may as well play with me and be on a video with me whenever I am on the server. So do that. There we go. I love the chairs. I love the benches and I love the table. I'm sorry guys, I love everything because the texture of the wood is very nice and I do love this. And this feels like it's a mini throne, which is very cool. And I just did this like really quick because there's a table, another table basically, and I love this table as well because it's not just a table. I, I feel like I said table way too many times on this segment. I'm gonna stop, let's go to the next one. There we go boys, we got a swing on this mod pack. You can interact with this swing, you can sit on the swing, but you cannot move the swing. So just to let you know guys that you can only sit on this swing, which is very nice. And again, I did that weird thing when I'm again saying swing a lot of times. So let's jump into the next segment. If you guys don't know what this is, there's a reason why I am not on cinematic mode and you'll see why, because it's a chest. It's pretty big actually, and the stone one is the same thing. And let me tell you guys, I love the wood chest as well. It's very nice and I love the design on the wood chest. It's so cool. What we got now is these two shelves and they are very nice. I love the fact that one is empty because at the beginning of the game, you might not be able to access books because you don't have a lot of stuff. And that makes sense, so I love the idea. Wait guys, the deer is talking to me. He wants to say something. Okay. Oh, oh I see you're right. What it just said to me is that if you're still watching the video, you might as well drop your like and subscribe if you actually enjoy and want to see more. So without more than less, let's continue boys. This was a surprise to me. You have weapons rack, which is very cool. You have the empty one and the one that has already some weapons inside and some tools. You cannot interact with this, at least from what I've seen and what I've tried. You cannot interact with any of those, so you cannot take any weapons from this weapon rack and neither you can put in on both so there's also that i would love that we could interact with this weapon rack it would be very cool but besides that it's still a cool idea even if you cannot interact with it i still liked it things that are nice here you have the cuckoo clock it's very cool i love the idea wine rack we have a bird house and these two big things that you see in there are small altars one has a candle and it's lit and the other one doesn't have anything which is overall nice i love the cuckoo clock it's a very cool idea i don't think it makes any sound but it would be very cool to have a cuckoo sound on that clock the mod also adds sculptures on stone and on wood as you can see the wood ones are very nice they are small they are very tiny they will fit very well in, in a shell for example this is also nice and i would say the stone ones because they are bigger they are outside decoration you can put this outside of your house on your garden or on your farm because it does make a lot of sense and they are bigger and they're made out of stone so they are likely to handle the wind and the rain but that's very nice you also have these bathtubs and one doesn't have anything and the other one is full of water as you can see i'm pressing e and i cannot interact with the tub and neither i can with this but there's something you can do which is jump inside turn your character forward and just press x and you will sit on the tub of course you should take your clothes to take a bath which i didn't do here but yeah maybe you cannot interact with the tub but i still think it's a good idea and it's very cool you also have these sculptures statues if you want to call it it's evil statues by the way you have the small ones and the big one which it's again outside the garden and you're wondering why do i have studios 
on the screen right now it's because they will be my company for the rest of the video so let's hear what they have to say mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you don't like it okay i can see one of the deals doesn't like it this is everything you have for the kitchen it's very nice that we have all of these decorations for the kitchen because now you can absolutely pretend that you are having a dinner with your viking friends so that's very nice and again i don't know why my viking has that big ass sword it's time to eat not to smash everything please stop it okay i'm gonna jump into the next segment he's just out of his mind feed me more Yes, destroy everything. There we go. Oh my soul. I cannot break this. There we go. My Viking is out of mind. I told you guys. Okay, I hope my Viking behaves. We have now baskets, two buckets, one big, one small, and all these candles. The candles are nice. Some of them are lit, some of them are not. So I think my favorite one is the bottle candle. It's very cool. More decorations. We have books in a lot of positions, vertical and horizontal, which is nice. We have a lot of scrolls, diary pages, you, you name it. There's a lot of stuff in here for you to decorate your table, which is very nice. This mod also adds these paintings. Come on, Viking, stop. I only need you to stop. I want to show this to other people. So please don't go ahead and smash this. Let me just show them. And the actual paintings don't look that bad. I actually enjoy what we're seeing on the screen. So that's a plus for me what a nice idea more tiny and big things they are very cool the barber thing it's very nice i don't remember the name. i'm sorry guys let me know in the comment what is the name of that barber spinning thing i totally don't remember wine man the smoking pipe the soap and it's also cool to just decorate the tub with the soap will be a very cool combination i would feel like this is my favorite items of the entire mod because I love the skeleton that it's a full body skeleton. It's so nice. The ripstone is very cool as well. We actually were missing that to make a graveyard. It's very nice. We have these skeleton piles that also make a lot of sense. They are very nice. I do enjoy this part a lot. And as usual, the video is over. Subscribe. First thing of the first things of the first things of the first thing. Okay, bet. Oh, yeah, sure, dude. What you want to say? Oh, I see. So what Deer is telling me is that if you guys are still watching the video, you might as well drop your like and subscribe. And you already know the reason. Okay, let's just continue the video. I feel bad for doing this. Everything that you see on this table is related to the kitchen. And I love like a lot of stuff. There's like... The plates look very nice. The texture of the wood is very cool. Also, I love the... Um, 